In campaign 2019, Philadelphia's election fraud task force is up and running. It comes ahead of next week's Pennsylvania primary. Natasha Brown joins us now from our satellite center to tell you about their mission. Natasha. Well, you keep preserving the integrity of any election. It is the number one priority of election officials and the district attorney's office. During Tuesday's primary election, dozens of eagle-eyed officials will either be watching polling places or ready to be deployed to make sure things go smoothly. We're concerned with crimes. If you see something that does not look like it should be occurring on Election Day, please call us. The Philadelphia District Attorney's Office will be deploying its election task force during Tuesday's Pennsylvania primary election. The polls open at 7 a.m. on May 21st, and voters will be streaming through to cast their ballots for both state and local elections. The task force will specifically be looking for those violating election laws, whether it be voters or candidates at the polls. It is a very large ballot this time around, and there will be many can candidates outside of polling places. It's important to remember that as long as they are 10 feet away from the doors, they are fine. Officials say candidates campaigning too close to polling booths is the most common complaint during any election. Also, those with disabilities need to know their rights as it pertains to voting. A voter can only have assistance in the polls if they have a disability, they are blind, or they are illiterate. With candidates running for mayor, city council, judges, and with important ballot questions, the election task force has an important responsibility to protect every citizen's voice uh, and vote. The task force of assistant district attorneys and as many as 20 DA detectives will be strategically deployed before the polls open and will remain there until the polls close and the last voter has cast a ballot. Well, the, DA, the DA's election task force, that is, has set up a hotline to call. If you see any violations at the polls on Election Day, you can go to our website, cbsphilly.com, to get the latest. They are also recommending that you double-check your polling location ahead of time so there's no confusion on Election Day. Live in the Sat Center, Natasha Brown, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Natasha, thank you.